Max B here, live at St. Ives. Frozen! No control to wake my face up in the morning. Skin burns through places. Harrison, Tom, no Declan, shame. and Isaac. They've just played an amazing gig, and I'm sure you boys must be hyped up on adrenaline right now. Definitely. Yeah, yeah. 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 Adrenaline's flowing, yeah. blood's flowing, you can't get down. It's why we do it, right? You were playing mostly songs from your album Mum's Favourites, is that correct? Yes. Yeah. Uh, the EP, yeah. yes. It's an EP. Yeah. <laughs> okay, it's it's a tremendous EP, and and at the moment you've got Gateway Bridge at number nine on the uh, Aubrey Wodonga music chart, so that's fantastic. So how long has Mum's Favorites been been sort of released? Uh, five six months now. Yeah. Six months. Yeah. And and what's the reception been with fans? Um, the local yeah, the local community are really just getting involved and. It, some of our mates, they absolutely love it. They sing all the songs with us at the gigs, and it's just it's a brilliant atmosphere to be around at this time. It's yeah. a good kind of atmosphere that it kind of delivers. Yeah. We didn't know it would do that, but Ready? it's um. See? It see just it see. It's, it just flows. It, it just flows. Yeah. It yeah. brings yeah. people yeah. in. It's brilliant. Really Look at us, smile. Yeah. How how are you feeling? See? <laughs> Positive reception. Yeah. How's your? How's your? How's your? How's your? <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah. Harry, what are your thoughts about that? About what? About Mum's favourites. Oh, I think it's been quite good. A lot of people enjoying it, and that's the main thing. As long as the fans enjoy it, yeah. that is the main thing. We're just here to have fun. You know, exactly, yeah. yeah. We're doing what we love, if people love what we love. Then it works, then it works. I can, I can really see that you guys have fun on stage with your performance, you get very into it. it, it it's just amazing. If, if you can, get down and see Poser next time they play. Have you guys got a next gig coming up? or? Uh, um, our, closest one, our closest one would be the what? Retro Battle of the Bands. Um, we'll be playing against some pretty awesome bands, a lot of our great friends from the music community. I reckon yeah. it is too good to miss, to be honest. Like, even if you don't really froth our music, like, there'll be some great people down there. So we'll make a post and maybe a cheeky video about it soon. If we feel it. We have a lot of, like, upcoming unannounced gigs as well, so yeah. just... Keep posting on our Facebook and we can keep you in touch with yeah. what's going on in the other post. If you're in our social media, then you're in the set. Well, well as, as Atomic Aubrey, I can say we're going to be posting on you guys a lot because you are up and coming, you are phenomenal, and you are one of the best bands, in my personal opinion, on the countdown right now. So you guys are doing a fair bit of promotional video work at the moment. Where do you get your ideas for, for those videos from? Um, yeah, here we go. <laughs> Most of our promotional videos were um, built on puns. Uh, our earlier ones were... Um, Especially at that first gig with the Ugly Kings, it was uh, us hanging off a brick wall, and we'd come along and gone. The whole video it was like a 30-second video for nothing, and it ended with, "Well, what are you doing? We're hanging out for a good gig." so much fun just to yeah. like and it's kind of become a staple and it's so much with easier. a lot of the stuff we've done when it comes yeah. to promotion and people always enjoy the videos it's kind of like we just pull whatever the gig has like um, whatever we're doing for it like with this one the May the 4th one of course we recreated the cantina scene from Star Wars which is pretty uh, pretty goofy and um, even with our own promotional videos on like uh, upcoming songs and albums and stuff it's, um, we've got our own characters and we play our own stuff and it's just kind of like building this whole poser world of just goofy the stuff. The multiverse of the poser. The poser it's, multiverse. It's, it's pretty great. dumb, but I mean, at the end of the day, people enjoy them and really, that's what we want. Even if it's music, even if it's videos, pictures, anything, yeah. we just want people to enjoy what we We're are doing. We're pretty much yeah. experimenting different ways to kind of just like reach out, I suppose. I mean, like, they're, more attractive. Yeah, they're more attractive <laughs> than a simple post where it's like coming out gig, like, May as well go to town on it, yeah. in for a penny, in for a pound. Yeah. yeah.
Uh, so, Harrison, Tom, Declan, Isaac, what are your favourite songs from Mum's Favourite Album? No, no, what are your Mum's Favourite Songs from Mum's Favourite Album? Oh, okay. My Mum's Favourite Song would be Alright, the last song on the album. Yeah, she doesn't stop talking about that one. <laughs> my Mum's Favourite is Mum's Favourite. And it's just weird because she hates heavy music, but when she listens to it, she's just like, wow, I don't know why I like this. And I'm just like, well, mom's it's weird, eh? Right. <laughs> um, my mum's favourite on the mum's favourite EP would be Gateway Bridge. She absolutely loves it, like, every time. I think she gets a bit teary over Tommy Boy's little time to escape with Onga. Uh, my favourite mum's mum's favourite would have to be Weekend Love. She likes the kind of slower music, but also that mix of it's got the heavier influence behind it. And it's kind of got that like real, real relaxed vibe, yet at the same time still has the poser element that we're known for. It's got that punch. <laughs> So Mum's Favourites came out this December and already you're trending on the charts, you're playing gigs, everyone's loving it. Are you planning to release more music soon or...? Uh, will the Harry take this? Yeah. Um, what do you reckon, Harry? We do have some things in the works. Uh, we are working on another, I guess you could say, EP. Um, yeah, just stay tuned and find out some more stuff later. So, yeah. We're always writing stuff, it's just a matter of what's good and what's crap and we just want to put our best yeah. foot forward yeah exactly yeah nothing really like announced but you know we're still running we're still exactly kicking. yeah cool. all right well that that's been great guys do you have any uh last messages for your fans that you, you really want to get out there through the atomic channel <laughs> I think really just stay tuned because we've got a lot more in the way and mum's favourites was just kind of phase one of Poser. Really, um, the, the more upcoming one, the more upcoming stuff we've really put our heart and soul into and we really reckon that our upcoming project you guys are really going to like, so please stick around. I have one more thing to say. Keep on coming, baby. <laughs> Okay, Harrison, Tom, Declan, Isaac, thank you so much for the interview and we look forward to hearing more Poser soon. Guys, congratulations. Well done.